everyone and welcome to Rolladed.com. In this video, I'll be showing you how to withdraw your money from Bybit.com. A lot of people have messaged me to show them how to withdraw their money from Bybit.com and I'm going to be showing you step by step in this video. Now, I have some funds on my wallet that I want to withdraw to Bybit. The first thing is to go on Spot, which is somewhere down the arrow. You can find assets down here. Look at assets, you click on assets. When you click on assets, this is the amount of USDT I want to withdraw. Now, I want to withdraw it to my bank account. This is on spot. As you can see, if it's on spot, you cannot withdraw it. You need to send it to your funding wallet before you can withdraw. Now, to do that, click on transfer. It's actually very easy. You click on transfer. This is a transfer. When you click on transfer, you change this directive to funding account. This is where you find the directive. Change it to funding by clicking on it and select funding. Funding is the last one on the list once you have selected funding change the btc because i'm sending you usdt not btc so you click on change it to usdt now i'm going to send everything out of my bybit account so i'll click on or then click on confirm transfer i'm taking this step by step for the sake of new people who are new to bybit now click on confirm transfer is very similar to that of binance once you click on confirm transfer you wait for a few minutes and you can see it's transferred successfully if you notice very well you no longer find your own spot again you will now be seeing it on funding from funding you can now send directly to your bank let me show you how to send it directly to your bank go to home this is the front page of the bybit app you can scroll down and click on p2p you can click on peer to yeah, it's very easy when you click on p2p this is where you're going to sell it now remember you want to sell so once once you want to sell you're going to click on sell instead of buy click on sell this, there are very assets here to sell but in our case we only want to sell usdt this is btc this is ethereum but we want to sell only usdt this is what you want to say so you click on it and click on say how much do i want to say i want to say only six usdt so i'll click on it before you click on say can you notice the a uh, kind of account to send this person is sending to only add cash you want a bank account transfer we don't want to add cash once again, you have to notice how much is this person currently selling. This person is selling between 20,000 to 1 million, 20,000 to 10 million, 5,000 to 10 million. So we have to go and type the amount we want to sell. To do that, you click on this place that says amount. Any amount you want to, just click on this place and to be self, just to be safe, just type the list amounts. Maybe you can type like 20,000 Naira. If you're not sure that you want to withdraw more than 2,000, just click type 2,000 and click on confirm. When you click on confirm, then you can now click on anybody you see on the list. According to what I'm seeing here, this guy has been online one minute ago. This person that is showing green is currently online. This person is showing green online one hour ago so don't click on him because he's not online so i want to click on the second guy because he is currently online so i'll click on sell once click on sell you have to wait for it to load and once it loads you click on all once you click on all now you want to select a payment method you want to select a bank account where this person will pay you click on a bank transfer or payment method click on payment method when you cl click on the payments method you find that you already have a bank account listed here now i want to add a new bank account where somebody can send money to i'm just going to click on add a new payments method you can see that the last person option the last option there in case you don't want any payments method i'll click on it then i'll just type my name or the name i want to the person of the account after that the account number i'll tap the account number so once you have typed in your new account number you just click on transform confirm and you can click on confirm you click on get code they will send me a code you click on get code so you can confirm the account number that you just added so you have to wait for the code and i'm waiting for the code to come and once the code comes you simply have to type it in and i'll click on confirm and it will be added now that you select a payment method where do you want to be paid you can see you receive a message that has successfully added a new payment method i'll click on the new bank want them to transfer my money to i'll click on this first one which is my bank and click on confirm when i click on confirm i just click on sell you can see the price has changed because i've actually wasted time click on it and i have to look for somebody else who will sell it to me i'll click on this first guy again immediately you click on all when you click on this you find that that is still asking you to ask and add a new payment because you have done it wrongly 
you are actually choosing somebody that is selling with cash so you go back you can see the mixtape i made now that this guy is selling by cash not bank transfer so you look for only people that have bank transfer to sell to and these people to sell to so you click on this second which is selling by bank transfer you can see he's now showing a bank transfer click on all select the bank you want them to pay to which is my assets bank click on confirm and click on sell once i've click on the sell it shows you the amount of money you're going to receive which look at it it's showing you that you're going to receive 5800 naira you can see it's actually easy and now bybit has given them 40 minutes to send your crypto after the 40 minutes is over if they have not sent it you'll be asked to repeat the process look for somebody else to sell your crypto to so i think this will be the end of this video so when the person has actually sent your money and you have confirmed you just go to this place which is release now and release the crypto don't release this until you're sure that the money is in your bank then Thanks for watching this video and bye for now.